Okay, so we're back at the beginning again, this time round. Uh, instead of a glossy print, we are going to print a satin uh, photograph. So, let's go back to here, and we have to go in and change the settings for the printer. Make sure that we've got a one that is correct satin. Change that from glossy to instant dry satin paper. Make sure the quality is correct. And go ahead and print that. And you can see this now rasterizing itself up to 245 meg. And that will take a little bit of time to get up to uh, uh, up to that number. Um, and like I said before, once it um, once it uh, finishes uh, spooling, um, it'll disappear off the screen, and then we'll go over to the printing side. So you can see now it's going up. Um, Sometimes this happens pretty quickly, sometimes it uh, it takes a little bit of time, but um, there's a lot of processing power uh, needed to do uh, uh, to do this. If you had a normal PC or a normal laptop, um, you wouldn't be able to do this. Almost there. Like I said, once it disappears, we'll go over to the printing side and pick up from that particular point there.